y'all, Shay here. Merry Christmas. Everyone's starting to get their diamond paintings prepared, so why not just get into it, okay? Now these are, we're gonna talk about last year's Hobby Lobby exclusive Diamond Art Club paintings, and then we're gonna talk about this year's, okay? And there's a couple of the reasons why I decided to pull out last year's. So let's talk about that first. So last year, Hobby Lobby had three Diamond Art Club paintings. There was Christmas Delivery, Starry Night Santa, and then there was Let It Snow. It was a snowman. I sold the snowman in a de-stash, so I don't have that one to show you guys. But all three of them were squares. See, you've got the squares here. And I was a little disappointed. I wanted a round option as well. Um, but these were exclusive to Hobby Lobby last year. A lot of things have changed this year. This one, Starry Night Santa, is actually available on Diamond Art Club's website as we speak. So today's filming is November 21st. So it is available on their website. So if you wanna go grab it, it's an awesome painting. And I will attach the, um, I did an unboxing last year, last Christmas. So I'll attach that um, unboxing video if you wanna go watch that, if you're interested in this one. And again, it is a square. And it's licensed artwork by Donna Gelsinger. And it's a 42 by, 42 by 57 in centimeters. Now, this one, Christmas Delivery, was also exclusive to Hobby Lobby last year. So this year, when I went to Hobby Lobby to look for the new ones, I saw it in Hobby Lobby. So it is, if you can find it in your stores, it is in stores. I did check Diamond Art Club's website and unfortunately it is sold out. So go check out your Hobby Lobby to see if you can find the new ones or this one. Uh, I'm not sure if this one's back in stock at Hobby Lobby. Mine didn't have it, but they might even have this one too. This one, Christmas Delivery, is Susan Wingett. It's a 51 by 51 and it's got the puppy in the back of the truck really really cute so again these were exclusive last year diamond art club is now carrying these if they're available okay so that was last year's paintings and i'll attach you know the video for those if you want to see the unboxings let's talk about what they've done this year i'm very happy they came out with rounds and these both are a little bit smaller great sizes you know because we have a lot going on during the holidays a lot going on in december so i love the sizes of these um i did have to go to two separate hobby lobbies to find these uh one hobby lobby only had these the other one had this so you might have to search around um, on their website it does show out of stock so you physically have to go to the stores and hopefully you have one near you um, if you're interested in any of these paintings diamond art club is not selling them on their website i did check and they're just exclusive to hobby lobby maybe next year kind of like they did with the with last year's um so we're gonna go ahead and unbox these okay first one is retro santa believe love this i can't believe they say it's retro this to me is like traditional santa i don't know if that makes me old but i love this um it is licensed artwork by susan wingett and get this y'all it's a 42 by 42 in centimeters and it is a round great size now hobby lobby is offering all their holiday decor right now and all these things 60 percent off so this one was retail, let's see, $49.99. I got it for, I think it was 25 with tax. Great deal. So run, don't walk, run to Hobby Lobby if y'all can and try to go find these. Okay, I actually need to go back. I've got some folks that don't have a Hobby Lobby near them and they've asked for me to go on the hunt for them and maybe grab some and they're gonna pay them for me and I'll ship them to them. So if that's something you're interested in, let me know in the comments if I can find them, okay? Uh, if I can find them, I'll go and I'll see. So let's start with, and then we'll check out this guy. Well, this is Love is Blind, and it looks like a little lab. This is also around, and it's a 33 by 33. So a little guy. He's got the ornaments. And again, it's another round. This was $36.99, so I think it was about $20. So love the sizes of these. The price is great. Great snack size. Um, I'm probably going to do one of these for Christmas, but I don't know which one. So I haven't decided yet. I did grab a few of these. They had only three left, and I bought all of them that they had. So yes. All right, let's start off with this one. And I have not seen him unboxed yet. I really do like this red border that they've included. And then you've got the mistletoe and the holly, and it says believe. Yes, okay, so let's get into this. So how are y'all? Hopefully you're having a good week. Um, it's almost Thanksgiving here in the States. So we're kind of prepping for that and getting the turkey and the food and all those things. Okay, always shake the box out. Oh, there's something in there. Oh, looks like the toolkit is stuck in there. Wow, they've really got it jammed in there. Let me see if there's anything else. Oh, looks like the logbook sticker. It's a little crunched. Now, these exclusive to Hobby Lobby kits do not look any different. Yeah, the sticker got a little crunched, but that's okay. You can put this on the side of your box, or you can put it in a logbook if you keep a paper logbook. 
and it's got all the information. And again, this is a sticker. It's really nice. A lot of people will stick it on the side of their box right here. So depending on how you store your paintings, if you can't see it on this side, you can see what it is from this side or that side, depending on where you want to put it. Okay. All right. So nothing else in the box, but yes, these are the same exact contents. Um, the only thing is, um, you know, you're not getting the uh, points for your diamond art club reward system. If you buy them from Hobby Lobby, uh, you do get to register these. So make sure you do that. But here's the toolkit. And y'all have probably seen these before, but I always like to see the washi tape and the cover minder that we get. Ooh, yes, I don't have this color. Awesome, and it kind of reminds me of Christmas themed. We've got some green themed items in here. Take a look. Oh, and pink. Things are rolling. Okay. Oh, okay, look at that, it's a little daisy. So many little goodies coming out of here. All right, so we've got this really pretty kind of a emerald green sparkly pen and then the squishy for the pen just for comfort it just slides on there it always matches the pen so you get one of those little grips you do get a glitter tray now the stopper comes out so you can pour your drills out so you've got your tray and then here's the fun washi tape this one's really pretty it's pink with some flowers very nice this will go with a lot of different paintings that's a good roll so here's your washi tape you get two little plates of pink heart-shaped wax. There is a plastic uh, cover on top of them, so go ahead and peel that off, the little film. And it comes in this cute little case. And then here's our cover minder. I don't have this one. It almost feels like clay or like a rubber. It doesn't move, but it's like a clay is the best way I can describe it. How cute. And it's got two magnets, you know, it's got the two magnets on the back and that just holds back your plastic. And then you get two thin white multi-placers, a seven and a four. They can go on the end of your pen. You can place more than one drill at a time. And then you get some baggies. So when you're finished with your painting, you can store your leftover drills in these. All right, so that's our toolkit. We'll just kind of slide that over here. All right, now it does come in a dust bag, okay? It keeps it protected. And there's normally a little, yep, here we go, a little adhesive here. We can just peel it off. Some folks do keep these bags to put them back in. It did get a little crushed, but that's not gonna be a problem. It's poor glue, and we're just gonna roll it back on itself and it'll flatten out just fine. But before we do that, let's do the drill reveal. Oh gosh, it's so soft. The canvases just feel like butter. They're velvety, very, very soft. Where are you the drills at, y'all? Are they hiding in here? Okay, and then we'll look at the other goodies that are in there. Let's do the drill reveal. Ooh, okay. Got some 948, and we'll look at all the drills in a minute. There we go. Ooh, I see a gold. So I didn't even talk about how many colors. But let's see, there are 36 colors, two ABs and one electro. That electro must be that gold that I'm seeing in there. You'll see that gold. Look at the color palette. We've got reds, greens, blues. Oh, awesome. And I see some red ABs in there. I can see the special coating of the ABs. AB stands for Aurora Borealis. And it's a special coating they put on the drills to make them sparkle just a little bit brighter than some of the others. Now, they do have the name of the painting on the bag. So if you want to store your painting separate than your bag, or you, some, some people hang up their diamond paintings with pant hangers and hang them in their closet, and then they'll store these in totes. So you can definitely do that, okay, if you don't have the room for a big box. But I love how they have them on there. We'll look at the drills in a sec. Now, there is a sticker in here, and then there'll be a Diamond Art Club brochure. So let's look at the sticker. So, oh, the image is so clear. Now we can see what he looks like. Look at him, he's winking and he's got some gifts and a stocking. Oh, I love this. Okay, so this entire sheet is a sticker. Sometimes what I'll do is I'll take that logbook sticker, this one, and I'll put it on the side of the box, and then I'll use this for my logbook. I'll just kind of cut this out, and it's got all the information on there. Again, it's around. Now, these are your stickers that you can put on your storage containers to kit up. These are peel and stick labels and they are individually cut. See that? You just peel them right off and put them on your storage containers. And they also give you some extras that you can save. There are 36 colors. That K444 must be that Electro. And then we've got anything under 150 with Diamond Art Clubs and AB. So we've got 107, 141. So those are gonna be our two ABs. Looks like a red and a white. And there's gonna be lots of reds and greens. Oh, y'all, let's take a look at the canvas. All right, oh, we gotta look at this. One more thing. I'm so excited to see what he looks like. So this is a, a brochure from Diamond Art Club. Thank you for your purchase. Never pay full price for Diamond Art Club, okay? Like I said, they have got an awesome rewards program. 
Uh, definitely use, you know, use these codes on your next, per your next purchase. There's coupon codes everywhere. But in here, it just talks about what's included in your kit. They do have a VIP Facebook group. They've got an instructional video and here's step-by-step -step instructions. And then of course, tips and tricks. And if you have any questions, download their app. They've got great customer service, all the good stuff, y'all. They're, they're top notch. All right, let's take a look at this painting. So what I always do is, oh, it's so, it's such a baby. It's such a tiny little guy. I love it. So I just kind of normally grab the edge of my table and kind of stretch it out, but this one's so small. Um, and because it is poured glue, oh, it just feels, it feels softer than usual. I don't know. Okay. Uh, what we're going to do is I'm just going to roll it backwards to flatten out just a little bit more. But Diamond Art Club does have self-flattening um, canvases, so they flatten out really fast. But for filming purposes, you can just roll this guy backwards and it won't hurt him at all. And if you just want to start diamond painting right away, what I'll do is I'll do this when I'm kidding up. I'll do this first and lay him out flat. And then as I'm kidding up, I just kind of give him time to rest. Okay, so you just squeeze this a few times. Y'all ready to see our cute little Santa? Oh, look at the vibrant reds. Oh, he's so cute. Oh my gosh, you guys, he's adorable. It's such a classic image for, you know, a traditional Christmas. I mean, I love this. Diamond Art Club did a great job. I am loving this. Love the size, love that it's round. Love the red and greens. Can't say enough good things about this. This is so cute. All right, so you've got up here, do what makes you sparkle. Diamond Art Club, that's their logo. They do put a legend right here on the top left. And there's also a legend on the bottom right. Down here, it's got a thumbnail and all the information about the painting. And here's some of their socials. And again, another code. And then here's their lifetime uh, warranty. So if you have any questions, just reach out to them. Okay, let's check the stickiness. Never, ever, ever had a problem so sticky with their stickiness. Let's take a look at the drill field. And what that means, we're just gonna see how clear the symbols are. I always like to look at the faces. Look at his cute little face. Yes. There's gonna be a lot of color blocking. This will probably work up pretty, pretty fast. Um, I say color blocking and that means there's all gonna be the same color all together. So you can just go, 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 go and not have to change. This looks like color blocking, but when you really look at it, there's some Y sprinkled in there. So you have to switch colors a little bit. The letters look really good. Sometimes letter can be, letters can be a little blurry. Yeah, looks great, no complaints. All right, shall we take a look and see where the ABs go and the electro? And let's also see where these other drills. Love this little bag. It's just so doable. This would be a great painting as a gift for someone if they're gonna um, if they're interested in diamond painting. And this would be a great starter kit for a Christmas gift for someone that you want to get into the craft. Yes, this would be great. All right, so I read that crinkle. I always tell y'all keep this bag. Prop it open just like this. See, it props open on its own. And use this, so whenever you're kidding up and moving these over to your storage container, you can just toss the empty bags into here and seal it up and throw it away. So always keep that bag. Oh, this is getting me in the Christmas spirit. This is what I needed. I needed to unbox this today. I'm gonna start pulling out my Christmas decorations for the house, and I'm gonna start decorating. So this is what I needed. Okay, we'll take a look at that set. Let's start with this one. Oh, these colors. Now, Diamond Art Club, oh, something's opened. That looks like just, looks like a little bit of trash, just like from a bag. So Diamond Art Club does put their drills in bags by quantity, okay? So that's, you can see how they're just small, and that's how they have their trains. So these are gonna be the smaller numbers. So this is 322, 893, 356, 355, 433, 758, 3778. Ooh, that's a fun color. 3819. It's like a lime green. 436. 645. 898. Ooh, fun color. 3801. 452. 745. 890. Ooh, 606. 451. 739. 989. And 3371. Now, I wonder if there's going to be any 310. I bet there will be. There's a 310's black, so I bet there'll be a little bit of black. And we'll take a look at those drills in a second. Actually, I'm not seeing any black. That is actually 3371. So there, there is no 10. There's no um, 310. There's no black. Awesome. 
All right, let's look at our second train. I haven't seen AB yet, but I'm sure they're coming. So we've got 435, 453, 3855, 498. Ooh, y'all, there's the AB 107. See that special coating on there? Compared to the other one next to it, see how it's got just a little bit of extra rainbow shine to it. Yes. We'll see where that goes in just a minute. I'm going to just pull that out so we can kind of put it aside and look at where that goes. So we've got 107. And then, let's see, we've got 938. So it's a brown. 3072. 986. 368. Ooh, there's a second one. There's 141. Got a white AB. Both of those bags are good size. I'm happy with those. Ooh, look at here. This is the electro drill. That's interesting. It's a gold, but I've never seen yellow bottoms. That's an interesting color. We'll have to put a few in a tray to really get a sense of what that looks like, but it's like a gold metallic drill. Kind of matches my nails. Ooh, that's going to be fun. I have never worked with an electro drill before from Diamond Art Club. All right, let me just pull these out real quick. So we'll have these readily available to look at. All right, let's see the rest of our colors. A lot of greens. We've got 987, 895, 964, 948. Two bags of 948. I bet that's going to be maybe the background. Yeah. And then one, two, three bags of 321. That's a beautiful fire engine red. Beautiful. Okay, I'm really happy with those. All right, let's see where these ABs go and this electro. So number one is number one, 107. And the ones, all right, I see them in like the berries right here. I see a couple of ones. I see some in his hat. There's a few over here in the berries. Let's see, there are some in his, um, in his suit right here, several ones. There's ones outlining his suit. Ones, okay, lots of ones here in the stocking. Oh, this is gonna be really good. I love this. All right, and then more in the holly here and through here. So not any. there's not gonna be any in the border. It's just gonna be highlighting Santa and the, the holly bushes all around, the mistletoe. That's awesome, okay. And then the second one will be 141. So it's that white and that will be number two. Okay, I see, it's gonna be in the center of the, of the, the mistletoe, of the berries, see? Right in the center of them. Um, I, oh, oh, his entire beard right here will be all twos. Oh, it's going to look so good. This part of his hat. Of course, more in the berries. See twos there. Twos here. Two right here. So in a lot of the white of his suit. Okay, I see a lot of white. A lot of that white AB. That's going to look really good. All in the white part of his suit. And then, of course, in the berries. Okay, and the mistletoe. Yes! All right, there's a big bag of this Electro. So let me grab the tray, I still have it out. And let's just take a little look. I can always take the, you know, I could put these back in a little baggie that they gave us. Let's see. I just wanna see how these shake out. I just wanna see the color. Okay, let's put some in there. Cause that yellow is kind of, you know, deceiving at first. So I wanna see what how they shake out. Yeah, look at that gold. Pretty. Ooh, that's gonna be so fun to work with. The gold, y'all can see that. I'm trying to get a good shake. Yeah, so we said the gold there. The gold is going to be the E symbol, okay? That's the very last one on the legend, the EK444. And that's going to be this gold border all along here, all the way down. That's gonna be that gold. Yes, let me see if I see it anywhere else. Oh, it's in this here where, okay. Yeah, so it goes, it goes, it does the border, but then it's also going to be in here and through here. And then there's parts of it here. And then I see some more E's right here. And then of course the entire border is gonna be that gold. All right, I wanna start working on this now. I mean, if this doesn't get you in the Christmas spirit, I'm so excited, you guys, I'm so excited. Um, I hope if, I hope y'all can grab this if you're interested. Um, I know they've had them out, I think, for a couple of weeks now. So definitely run to your Hobby Lobby and see if you can snag some. And I would grab more than one just in case. All right, I'm going to pause and we're going to pull out uh, the puppy next. I'll be right, right back. We are back with Love is Blind. It's beginning to look a lot 
like Christmas. I don't have the best singing voice, but I definitely love Christmas. So we're gonna sing it out, y'all. This one retailed for $36.99 because it is a little bit smaller than the other one. And I think it came out to be like 20 something. So both super, super affordable. Ooh, is that the sticker? Oh, okay. A little different, a little different. We'll have to take a look at that. Shake, shake, shake. Shake out the box. Okay, let's take a look at this. So here is the logbook sticker. There's our cute little puppy, Love is Blind. And it's licensed artwork from Marilyn, is it Kavanov? Is that how you pronounce her name? I love the stars back here. I wonder if those are going to be ABs. And again, it's around 33 by 33 in centimeters. Now, what is this? This might be exclusive to Hobby Lobby. Warranty and insurance card. Okay, this where it talks about registering it. Perfect. So definitely go register your canvas. I wonder why the other one didn't have this in there. Hmm. Okay, so let's take a quick little look at the toolkit. We won't go through all the, the you know, everything that's included because we've already opened up one, but I just want to see what the special goodies are. I know a lot of people like to see the different options of what come in there. Ooh, all right. This time it's like a brown, like a really like a mauve. Ooh, I don't have this. It's like a wine color, a pen and squishy. And the washi tape is really fun. It's got all the different colors of lines. And then what is our haven't seen this one either. What's our cover minder look like? It's a macaroon or a macaron. I know I say it wrong. It's half. I have to tell my husband that I got this. He always makes fun of me. Mac macaron, macaroon, macaroonie, macarons. I don't know y'all. I always say it wrong. All right, that's hilarious that I got that and I had to say it, but that's one of the words I can't say. So that's everything you get. And here's another dust bag. This guy is so small. This would be great like if you're traveling and you're going out of town for the holidays. And you can take it on the airplane, you can take it over to a family's house, and it's not too big. So this would be a great size to travel with. Again, a little squished on the end, but as you saw in the last one, it really, once you fold it backwards, it's fine. All right, so let's do the drill reveal on this one. Right off the bat, there is a red AB. Wow. All right, ooh, look at all the purples in here. That's surprising. A lot of purples. Reds, of course. A lot of purples. Where's the purple coming from? Oh, that background's gonna be purple. Little pack of drills. Look at that. And of course, it's got the name of the painting right here. And this one, the colors, let's see, there's 44 colors. Wow, that's a lot of colors in this size. 44 colors, including one AB and one iridescent. So it sounds like we have another special drill. Let's go ahead and pull the sticker out. Yeah, so that background's gonna be a purple color. I thought it was gonna be a blue. Again, entire thing's a sticker. It's got 44 colors, one, two, so it's got 114, looks like a red, five, so I don't see a white AB in here. So you can always enhance it. We'll have to see how that looks, but that'd be really pretty in the background if you did white or um, you know maybe a crystal in there if you're up for enhancing it with extra stuff. Okay, so that's our sticker. And then here is the brochure that we already went through, so you know what that's all about. Okay, let's get into this little baby. Oh my goodness, look how tiny he is. Y'all, I've been doing some bigger ones lately, so this guy is adorable. Which way do I even put him? Okay, so let's roll him backwards. He's so great. This would be perfect to travel with, I'm telling y'all. Definitely try to get the puppy. Love is blind. And I love the red ornaments. Or if you have a friend that has a lab or a golden retriever, that's what it looks like. All right, let's see what this cute little guy. Okay, puppy. Oh my goodness, look at him. Oh, he's adorable. He's yawning with his big Santa hat on and look at the sparkly ornaments. Oh, I can't believe there's 44 colors in here. How? How is there 44 colors in here? All right, we already checked the stickiness. Let's just check this one, very sticky. Let's check the drill field on this one. Let's look at his tongue. It's got the different shades of pink and red. Very clear. It looks like there's going to be some maybe black, some 310. Look at his little nose, little pepper nose. Okay, so again, Diamond Art Club up here. Got the legend, almost takes up the entire painting on the left. Another one on the right. All, everything on the bottom that you need. Let's take a look at these drills. Yeah, I love this one. This might be a fun one to work on. I still need to decide what my next one's going to be. Oh, it might be 3371, that dark color. Just like the last one, there was no 310. Yep, I think that's what it's gonna be. All right, let's see if there's two trains or just one. Ah, 
Looks like just one really long train, maybe? Wow, they're sticking together. Okay, there's actually two trains. Oh, yeah, there's two trains. All right, oh, three trains. Let's start with this one. Wow, they're like a snake. A little snake trying to get away from me. Oh, this one's really long. All right, let's go through the colors. It's like a gray, 317, 894, 3799. Oops, sorry about that, y'all. 413, so gray, 3778, 760, 779, 3857, 355, 356, 3705, really pretty pink, 3830, a lot of brown, I guess, for the puppy, 938, 898, so another brown for the doggy, 3860, 451, 433, 648, 3801, and here's one of our ABs. Okay, this is surprising to me. 114, it's a coral color. That is really, I thought it was gonna be a red. Yeah, that's definitely got an orange tint to it. Okay, all right, I trust y'all. I trust Diamond Art Club. We'll see how that goes in a second. And our other train, a really pretty blue. We've got 336, 3024, 452, 738, a little bag of 5200, that's white. 3861, these are all pretty small bags. 30, now I see where all the colors are coming in. A lot of little bags. 3747, 157, 434, 437. Oh, you guys, we got a silver one. Maybe that'll be in the stars. Okay, Diamond Art Club, it is, you guys. I said a crystal. So we've got a gold in one of them and a silver in the other. Okay, I'm here for this. Loving that. I am so happy that that's going to be in the stars. All right, let me take that out. Set that here. And then we've got 666, really pretty red. 712, 341, 436, 435, 3371, 814, 321, and 498. Those are great reds. And then here look, looks like the background is, we've got 739, and then here is the, the background. We've got 340, but then there's, oh, it is different colors. I thought it was all the same. 340, 3746, and 155. So really pretty shades of purple. It's a purple blue. Okay. So let's go ahead and see where the AB and this crystal goes. So the AB is 114, and that's going to be that coral. And that's one. I'm just gonna kind of start off on the top. Okay, I do see some in his hat. Oh, okay, interesting. So you see the ones right here. There's a line of them here, here, kind of outlining the lighter part of that red. So they're gonna be here. There's some sprinkled in through here in the middle. And where else do I see them? So a little bit in the hat. And let's take a look at the ornaments. Yes, I see some down here in the ornaments. And this, there's nothing in this one, but I do see some over here. And then in this ornament, some right here in that line on here, and then outlining this area, those are all ones. And then there's some more over here. Okay, that's cool. I'm glad they went with a different shade of red, like a coral, kind of just make it look a little different. And then last but not least, this beautiful silver. So 5200 L, L 5200 is the little dot. All right, and that will of course be in the stars. Look at that. The star is gonna have that silver in here, and here, 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 inside the ornaments. You can see the little dots right there. Inside here, and the white of here. Uh, don't see it in here. Is there any in the peppers and his little hat? Nope. It's really gonna be highlighting these stars. That's gonna be gorgeous. Okay, y'all, I really needed this unboxing. Like I said, I've, it's almost Thanksgiving and I really wanted to start pulling out all my Christmas decorations and start getting into this the holiday spirit. And I wanted to unbox these and I'm so glad I did because this definitely is getting me there. So um, if y'all have any questions or any comments or any concerns, just send me a, you know, put me a message down in the comments and I'll definitely respond back to you. If you enjoyed this, please give me a thumbs up. They really do help. And if you have not subscribed, there is a subscribe button down below. 
click on that, it's free. It just lets me know that you like what I'm doing here. And if you wanna see more, there's a notification bell right next to the subscribe button. Click on that and you'll get notified every time I post up any new videos. All right, I'm gonna get out of here and go put away my cute little paintings and maybe start getting out my Christmas decorations. All right, love y'all so much. Uh, take care and I'll see you in the next one. Okay, bye guys.